Samuel Pepys' diary, 10th of January, 1660. Went out early, and in my way met with great wrecks, and at an alehouse he showed me the first sphere of wire that ever he made, and indeed it was very pleasant. Went to Mr. Cruz and borrowed ten pound, and so to my office and was able to pay my money. Thence into the hall, and meeting the quartermaster, Jennings and Captain Ryder, we four went to a cook's to dinner. Thence Jennings and I into London, it being through the heat of the sun and a great thaw and dirty, to show our bills of return, and coming back drank a pint of wine at the Star in Cheapside. So to Westminster, overtaking Captain Oakshot in his silk cloak, whose sword got hold of many people in walking. Thence to the coffee house, where a great confluence of gentlemen, Mr. Harrington, Pulteney, Chairman, Gold, Dr. Petty and Company, where Admiral discoursed till nine at night. Thence with doling to Mother Lambs, who told me how this day Scott was made intelligencer, and that the rest of the members that were objected against last night, their businesses were to be heard this day, Senite. Thence I went home and wrote a letter, and went to Harper's and stayed there till Tom carried it to the postboy at Whitehall. So, home to bed. <laughs>